Ted, Ted Art It bookmark corner time again. This is a different type of corner bookmark. Um, I think it's super lovely, super fun. I saw it on a channel called Dynamite Decor. Um, they don't seem to be active anymore, so I thought, you know what? It'd be really nice to share this lovely origami butterfly with you today. I think it's super clever, super cute, and qu quite quick to learn how to make. So come on, <laughs> let's take a look and see how they're made. So you'll need not a square piece of paper, but you need a rectangular piece of paper. And the ratio for the rectangular piece of paper is roughly, there's a two here and three across. So by folding it over by a third and cutting that off, we have the right sort of proportion. So it's gonna be 15 by 10 for my butterfly. So three and two. Now, you have to choose whether you want your butterfly contrasting colours to be the blue on this side or on this side. I want the blue to be on the main butterfly, so I'm going to turn it around, and the green on the other side. You can use um, two-tone, you know, white and yellow but, uh, paper. You don't have to use this two-coloured um, origami paper, or you can just use white paper. It doesn't really matter, and then decorate it with pens. It's totally up to you. The first thing you need to do is create the first fold, which is fold it up. I'm going to now flip it, so my fold's at the top. Fold in half. Open. And I'm going to take my finger, push it between until I get to the point at the top. This creates kind of a triangle. So I'm going to squish it down, aligning this center fold and creating a triangle. Fold this triangle over. Fold this up and repeat. So I'm going to put my finger in to right to the top. And this is going to help me create this triangle. Push it down and fold. You can see it also nicely aligns over here. Now you're going to open it. So this fold comes back. So you have on both sides. So all I did was I folded this open, yeah. Now I'm going to take this corner here and fold it up. Now this isn't an exact science, it's just a question of preference, but just pointing up a little bit with a little bit at the end here. And I'm going to repeat on this side and make sure that it matches this side. So it's got the same amount peeping out and it's kind of overlapping by the same. Give it a good crease. This crease will really help you. F fold open. And now you're going to pull this bit in and fold. And the same on this side. I'm going to open it and just push it through. And if the crease is neat, it will fold in really easily. Right, we're almost there. <laughs> now to turn it into butterfly, we take one of the two flaps and fold it down. Now you can choose whether you want a fat body or a thin body. I think thinner is a little bit nicer. And then you bring this one down and you have your butterfly bookmark corner finished. Aren't these fabulous? I take my book, open it. This now neatly pops over the edge. Isn't that adorable? Super easy, super fun. A different type of butterfly bookmark. Corner. Now, um, I've got a new paper crafts book coming out in September. Do keep an eye out for it. Um, and I think you'll really, really enjoy it. We love crafting with paper, so many great ideas. But in the meantime, um, if you like this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Above all, keep watching, keep making. I'd love to see you here again soon. Take care. Bye.